Turn to God. Turn to God. People of America, turn to God. Turn to God. Repent of your sins. Repent that the kingdom of God is near. Repent. Repent, people of America. Repent. Turn to God. Turn to God. Turn to God. Jesus is coming back. Jesus is coming back, people of America. Today we came here to let you know that God wants you to turn to him, to turn away from your sins, to turn away from the world teaching, to turn away from your wishes, to turn away the wicked way of this world, and to turn to God, to turn to his love, to turn to his coming, because Jesus is coming back, the King of kings, the Prince of Peace is coming back, He's coming back to take his children home. He's coming back to take those who trust in him, to take those who believe in his name. Because the Bible says, for those who believe him, he gave the power to become children of God. So Jesus is coming back to take his children. Jesus is coming back to do the judgment on the sin because God already made that decision and sin is going to be judged and that day is coming closer and closer Jesus is coming back he's coming back he wants you to be ready for his arrival God wants you to be ready to make your home ready. Hell is not a place for you and me. God did not prepare that place for you and me. He prepared it for a devil. But the devil is deceiving you by making you trust only on yourself, by making you trust him, by thinking that you are only the one who decides for your life. But it's not true. God wants to enjoy in your life. God wants to change your life for good. Don't be deceived by the teaching of this world. Jesus is real. God is real. And Jesus is coming back to take his children home. Jesus is coming back to take his children home. I 
Are you ready for his arrival? God loves you so much. He keeps sending people for you to remind yourself, for you to know his love. So you don't have to be judged by your sins. So you don't have to stand in the throne of God on judgment day. So Jesus can show his blood for you because he already paid it. He paid it before 2,000 years ago. But it is your choice. It is your time. It is your decision to receive him for you to be saved from the day of judgment, for you to be saved from your decision of your sins. God wants to come to your heart. God wants to come to your family. God wants to come to your home and your city and turn it to good. He knows your heart. He knows your ways. He actually knows you from your mother's womb. Before you know yourself, God knows you. And he said, turn to me. Turn to God. Turn away from your sins. Turn away from your ways. Turn to God. Repent of your sins. Repent. The Bible says, For all have sinned and have got shortened from the glory of God. Everyone did wrong. You and me have did wrong. But God said, His Jesus, He said, His only begotten Son. So whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Have you given your life to Jesus? Hi. Have you given your life to Jesus? God loves you. God wants you to turn away from your sins and to trust Jesus for your sins to be washed away. To trust Jesus to do what is right for you and your home. To trust Jesus for you to do right for your city, for your country, for your world. But you need to turn away from your ways, your choices, and choose God. And ask God the way. Ask God what to do. He is there to help you. He is there to show you the truth. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one come to the Father except through me. No one will be able to stand before God except by, by Jesus. If you don't believe in Jesus Christ, you will stand before God on judgment day. And you will be judged by your wrong choices. You've been lying. You've been deceiving people. You've been choosing to, for yourself. You've been selfish for yourself. And God will judge that. Because that is sin. God bless you. But Jesus, he paid the price so you won't have to be judged. Jesus came before 2,000 years ago. So you won't have to stand before the throne of God and be judged for your wrongdoings. And now he's coming back to take his children home. He's coming back with glory to judge unseen so turn away from your ways turn away from your sins ask forgiveness from God ask God to forgive you admit you are a sinner and trust what Jesus Christ has done for you on the cross 2000 years ago that is enough for your sin to be washed away that is enough for you to be a children of God. That is enough for you to skip the throne of judgment because you trust the only gift that God has poured out for you. And that is Jesus. God loves you so much. He wants you to see his love. He wants you to see him, how he cares. He keeps sending people. He keeps sending people for you to see his love. So before the time is over, before the time is done, prepare yourself for the kingdom of God. Because the kingdom of God is coming. It's in your midst. Turn away from your sin. Turn to God. Turn to God. Today 
serve you. Your education will not serve you. Your hard work is not going to serve you from the, the judgment of sin. The only way for your sin to be forgiven is by trusting Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, by trusting him on what he did for you. So today I tell you, turn to God. Repent of your sin. Ask God to forgive your sin. Ask God to forgive you, your country's sin. Ask God to forgive your home sin. Come before him with repentance. Admit you are wrong. He is willing to forgive you. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. No one will be able to be perfect before God except by trusting Jesus and what he has done for you. Today I tell you to turn to God. Turn to God. Turn to God. Oh my god. And in the Laragon. Ah, yes. Nice. God bless you guys. We are trying to do the. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Did you ask God to forgive your sin? Did you trust Jesus and what he has done for you on the cross 2,000 years ago? Because God will judge sin. And if you do not trust Jesus, you will be judged by your sin. And your sins will be your sins will be shown in front of God. And God has to send a judgment on you. And the judgment of sin is death. But God doesn't want you to be judged. He doesn't want you to death eternally. That's why God gave you Jesus Christ. He wants you to be ready. People of America, God loves you. He wants you to be ready for his arrival. Jesus loves you. Turn to God, people of America. Turn to God. God loves you. Ask for 
forgiveness from God. He is willing to give it to you. The Bible says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. Whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. God wants to give you eternal life. The life that start here and that goes forever. But you need to turn away from your sin. You need to trust Jesus Christ who died on the cross for you. And he who is ready to come to take his children home. Turn away from your sin, America. Turn away from your ways. Turn to God. Turn to God. Turn to God and be ready because Jesus is coming back. The King of Kings, the Prince of Peace is coming back. He's coming back soon. And he wants to wake you up. He wants you to be ready. He wants you to wake up and to get, to get ready for his arrival. Jesus is coming back. God 
wants to give you everlasting life with the Prince of Peace, Jesus. But you need to turn away from your sin. It is your time. It is your time. The day of salvation is to die. It is to die. You make a decision to turn away from your sin. To turn away from the things you think is going to save you. It's only one way. There is no other way. It's only one way. And that is Jesus. It's only one way. Turn away from your sins, people of America. Turn to God. God want to forgive your sin. He already sent Jesus. He, Jesus already paid the price for you. But you need to ask God to forgive your sin. You need to repent. Repent from your sins. Repent, people of America, repent. Repent. Turn away from your sin. Turn away from your ways. God's way, God's plan is greater for you. And God said, Jesus is coming back. The days are being numbered. You need to be ready for his arrival. Be ready for Jesus' arrival. Turn away from your sin. Turn away from your ways. Turn to God. People of America, turn to God. God loves you. Turn to God. Turn to God, people of America. Turn to God. God loves you. Jesus loves you. Give your life to 